placing on nearly in first place.
That one's one that's really good in terms of being really feminine necked and feminine headed and good through her front one third. Uh, balances up nicely from the side as well. Good single entry.
The prayer's lost, and that will be first, second.
the one there and, and there in the, the first class, that one's one that's really good in terms of his chest floor, in terms of how he's built through his front one third. Love how long body that one is and stout end in terms of front behind. He doesn't handle his handle his rear two probably as well as what he needs to. He gets a bit gets a bit um, get, gets a bit more too much set to it back there in his rear two than what I probably need to be ideal. Uh, probably not quite as mature in terms of being crisp over his rolling edge as well, but I think some time that will come and he'll open up with a bit more mass there in terms of her center body. I think that one's one that's put together really well out here and still has some muscle and shape from behind. Uh, one there in second, that, there in the uh, second class, that one's one that's got some look to him from the side. He isn't as unique in terms of his chest or in terms of his front end or in terms of how much true muscle shape he has from from behind in relation to, really in my mind, either of the two around him, but that's a nice sheep. If we can change his chest floor and pull, pull him up there, deepen him down in his flank and just make him run more uphill, I think we can start talking about possibly about possibly using him or maybe tying into him a bit more out here in this relative deal. The oldest one there has got some maturity and you can certainly see that in his chest floor. He's got some muscle and shape and dimension though. He looks good from the side. Ultimately, for me, the one that I think is just the more unique one is going to be that one right down there. He's going to be your champion. We'll follow him up with the oldest one there for reserve.
up here and, and we latch on to the one that's more opened up in terms of screws, skeletal width and dimension to go ahead and win. That one's one that's also better in terms of out of her hip, in terms of being level or hip to better there in that regard. Take a nice U there to start. Yeah, uh, one there in seconds, really good in terms of her front end and I, I love those things about her. She's good in terms of her front one third. We got to make her stronger out of her shoulder and make her level or down her top then fix her out of her hip and just ultimately give her more true side, true shape and width and dimension from the side in terms of lower one third of her leg as well. But a really nice set there for, for, uh, for your uh, class of dorsets. Please give those exhibitors a big round of applause. Thank you. 